This year's Akwazasne Freedom School annual dinner and quilt auction was held at Generations Park. This event has been held for decades to help support the school's operating costs and infrastructure. The community of Akwazasne is amazing for all fundraisers. Anytime we need help, our people come together and we really lift each other up. And the community has been supporting the Freedom School for 45 years now. Um, we're a parent-led school. We don't get state funding. We don't get provincial funding. Everybody's working. The parents are cleaning. The teachers are here every day. So when the community comes out for annual dinner, it's really such a great feeling. The Akwazasne Freedom School annual dinner and quilt auction was filled with vendors, activities, and performances that centered around the Kenyakahaga culture. Oh my daughter, all I want is to speak my language with you. I know you get frustrated cause I don't know what you say. Sargent provided updates on the Akwazasne Freedom School's new building and its status of completion. The new school building is now at about 70%. We're almost there. Walls are going up inside. Floors are down. The roof is up. So the building fund is a separate fundraiser. We'll have a table set up if people want to come and give donations on my program's website, foafs.org. We have a donation page. Please send money. We're still short of our goal. We're so close. We're trying to get in there by the end of September. Our students have been waiting for a new building. It makes me emotional. <laughs> our students have been waiting for a new building for 40 years. So we have teachers now who were told they were getting a new building when they were students. So it's going to happen. It's so close. It's happening. If you would like to donate today, please go to the Friends of the Akwazasne Freedom School website at foafs.org. Nyawak Gawah.